All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're here at Black Friday Trade Show and Networking Event hosted by All Black Market, and I'm here with... Eshe. How are you doing? I'm good. I'm good. Good, good to hear. Good to hear. So you're one of the vendors for today. So quickly, in about 30 seconds, just tell me about what your business is and what you'll be selling. All right. So um, my name's Eshe. I'm the founder of Sugar Plum Scrubs. So we make fresh lavender body care products with lavender that I grow in my garden. We have facial scrubs, we have body oils, and we have body scrubs. Um, I've been in the business since 2019, and um, I operate all throughout London, Toronto, and the GTA. Yeah, we just promote how important it is to relax, to feel good, to take an extra moment for yourself. And we really want people to believe that they deserve to feel beautiful, feel strong, feel um, emotionally um, safe. And we feel like our products kind of emphasize the importance of doing just that. I love that. And one thing to mention, she's probably one of the hardest workers out there for sure. So I'm um, got to give you props to that. But... Which is why I did this. Because <laughs> when you work so hard, you definitely need to find things that help you to reach your equilibrium and like relax. Mm. So, you know, taking an extra moment in the shower and the bathroom just to kind of rejuvenate yourself adds to your ability to show up and show, um, show out, if you will. Definitely, definitely. So how does it feel to have the opportunity to be here at Black Friday, especially considering there's so much Black vendors and Black entrepreneurs here at this event? No, it's amazing. I'm really glad I got the opportunity to be here. Um, I was invited by a friend who was also asked to be a vendor, and I really appreciate being um, able to not only showcase and sell products, but be able to connect with other Black entrepreneurs within um, all throughout Ontario. Also, it's nice to be able to support other business owners who are doing things that are similar. I'm really looking forward to the pitch competition. That's going to be fantastic. And learning about how to um, scale one's business, I think, is something that's going to happen here as well as some networking. So I'm looking forward to that. I love that. I love that. So how would you say you try your best to stand out in a room full of entrepreneurs? Well, I think it's important to really know who you are and know what makes you unique. Um, and to really emphasize that. So for myself, I know I have a self-care business, so it's very important to me to make sure that I feel good. And in order to feel good, I need to make sure I'm taking care of myself. And then I'm able to take care of other people. So in a room full of entrepreneurs, when my emphasis is taking care of other people, I make sure that when they come to my booth, they feel comfortable, they're able to try products, they don't feel forced or rushed to purchase. Because this isn't about um, how much money you can spend or how much money you can make. At the end of the day, it's about how good can you feel when you leave a space and or an interaction with myself and with my business? I love that. You, you're, I hope you guys are listening at home when you're watching this video, okay? It's not always about just getting the sales, the comfortability, exactly. feeling comfortable. I love that. I love that. Okay, so what would you say is your biggest superpower when it comes to your business? Um, I think my biggest superpower would have to be knowing when to pause. Um, and to reflect and when to ask for help. Yes. Those are the three things. I think a big part of my business has definitely been, you know, go, 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 go out to markets, network with people, meet, um, get the help. But what I didn't realize was getting the help is what needs to happen too. So reaching out to your friends, fellow vendors, fellow business owners, and asking them for their guidance will help you to move forward a lot quicker and with a lot less stress. So getting the help I need definitely something that I'm learning but the superpower is knowing when to pause because that moment where you pause and you reflect that's where all of the answers show up but if you don't pause and you're always go 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 you don't get any answers yeah that's so true it's always important to just pause and take your time with things there's never a rush okay honestly you're, you're kind of blowing my brain right now it's like the amount of gems that you're dropping I love it I love it I have one, yeah <laughs> I have one final question it's a little bit of a curveball what celebrity would you love to have dinner with? That's a great question. That is a great question. You would have had to ask me that question like half an hour ago so that I know exactly how to answer. Um, Steve Harvey. He's the first person coming to mind for me. I like Steve Harvey. He has a presence about him and a bit of a swagger, but he's about his business. And I like that. I like um, he also kind of embodies taking care of yourself and taking care of the people that you love. And that's a big part of this business. And so I would have dinner with Steve Harvey. Okay, I like that answer. I like that. You'd definitely be cracking jokes as well. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> and it's important to be laughing because, mm -hmm. you know, life can be serious. 
I'm too serious sometimes and doesn't speak. Yes, well. yes. Okay, just I need to do one more thing. I want you to look right into that camera and just convince people, tell people to go follow all black markets. All right, go follow all black market, everyone. You're gonna not only get a bunch of gems, you're gonna get connected to leaders, industry leaders that you need to be connected to. You're gonna be able to find mentorship, you're gonna be able to network, um, and then you'll also be able to vend. Um, so follow them right now, it's very important. <laughs> And yeah, feel free to follow me too at Sugar Phone Scrub. Mm -hmm, I love that. Eshe, thank you so much. Appreciate the interview, and I hope you have a wonderful time today.